Welcome everybody to Dispute It. My name is Andrew, and today we are talking about the Savage Access 2 Precision and 270 Winchester. Um, to start things off, this is a 22 inch bull barrel with a one in 10 twist. Um, it was threaded, I put a uh, muzzle brake on here. Um, this is M-Lock rails, so I put a uh, UD UTG uh, cheap little bipod on here. I think I paid, uh, it was like 45 bucks or something like that on Amazon. Um, this chassis system is the MDT proprietary one, only for the Savage Access 2 Precision. Um, it is aluminum with this green part is all polymer. Um, it does come with the MDT um, five round box mag. Um, it has a cheek riser, which you can go and buy the quick adjustment pieces for it. Um, they sell them on MDT and on Oryx chassis. Um, I think they're like 10 bucks. Um, length of pull is adjustable. Um, I'm six foot tall with uh, fairly long arms. Um, I had no problem with it at all. Um, it does have an ambidextrous mag release and the MDT um, pistol grip. I will say that this pistol grip feels great in my hands. Um, again, I have fairly decent sized hands and I love how it actually has this little resting place for my thumb, which is amazing for me. Um, I, I love shooting with my thumb on there for some reason. It just feels more comfortable. Um, I did top it off with the Athlon Argus BRT uh, 8 to 34 by 56. Um, this thing is sweet. It is a first focal plane. Um, I also topped it off with 30 millimeter rings. Uh, these are the Vortex Pro Series. Um, super sweet rings. Um, I will say um, I only shot about 25 rounds through this, so it has not been broken in yet. Um, even with that amount of rounds going through it, um, the Federal Premium that I shot through here was awesome. I think it was uh, one MOA or it was like sub MOA. Um, I can't remember off the top of my head, um, but for some reason the uh, Hornady Super Performance um, did not shoot as well. Um, maybe once the break-in period actually happens, maybe it'll actually be a little bit better. Um, the The wind was extremely, extremely windy. Uh, I believe it was 15 mile an hour winds um, the day that I went shooting, but for the most part, I mean, they were both 30, uh, 130 grain rounds. So it shouldn't have been that much of a difference on how much of a fly off it was, which you'll see here shortly whenever um, you see the uh, zeroing in portion of this video. All right, at first we're gonna be using some of this uh, Federal Premium. It is uh, 130 grain, 270 Winchester. Let's see what we can do. We're gonna go up for right. Last shot. Uh, 
All right. And then up next, we have some Hornady Super Performance, 130 grain. Let's see how well that does. We are going to be going upper left. We are safe. Let's go see how we did. All right, at first, we have some Federal Premium 130 grain. We're gonna go lower right. All right, and then up next, we have some Hornady Super Performance, 130 grain. Do another three shot group. Now we'll just load them up individually. And we are gonna go middle. and put them in there. Woo! That one pulled far. see how we did all right here's a fun little special treat for everybody
If you like the video, subscribe, give me a thumbs up, and remember, just do it. Thanks, guys.